Tonight is a continuation of our George P. Schultz lecture series held here at the Marines Memorial Club in downtown San Francisco. Secretary Schultz will introduce our speaker for tonight. Africa includes all of Africa except Egypt. So in all that northern Africa, the Maghreb is part of his domain. And uh, it is going to be fascinating to hear him talk about what's going on in, in those fields. And I'm really uh, feel privileged that we have him here at the Marine Memorial for this lecture share series. And it's a great pleasure for me now to call on General Ham to address us. General Ham. The thing that keeps me awake at night more than any other is the thought of a Somali American, uh, pa American passport holder, finding his or her way to Somalia to one of the Al Qaeda Al Shabaab training camps. Uh, uh, getting trained uh, and then finding their way through the security apparatus because they're American passport holders, and then finding a way to attack uh, a, a site inside our country and killing a number of our countrymen. That to me is mission failure for me and for US Africa Command, and we've got to do all we can to prevent that. So I talk about, again, these three organizations, Al-Shabaab in the east, Al-Qaeda in the lands of the Islamic Maghreb in the Sahel, and Boko Haram in Nigeria. Each of the three independently a dangerous organization. But what concerns me more than each individually is their stated intent to more closely align, synchronize, and coordinate their efforts. And that, to me, is what is most dangerous to us. The establishment of a terrorist network that would extend from Somalia through East Africa, across the North, through the Sahel, and into West Africa would be indeed a very, very serious threat to us in the sharing and collaboration of training, financing, uh, weapons, uh, and communication. And so that inter interdicting that network, to me, is one of our highest priorities. Maybe the great partnership is the Chinese provide the craft, we provide the training for the forces that operate in the craft, and you get the best of both worlds. How could anything be more important than being in a combat zone and, and frankly, carrying some baggage for, uh, for having lost uh, so many soldiers. And, and, I, and, I, and I was just wrestling with that. We shouldn't be shy about saying, you know, I need a little bit of help. We've got great systems. We've got great programs. We want wonderful chaplains, uh, mental health professionals, commanders, friends, mentors, family members. Uh, and if you need a little bit of help, and no harm in saying you need a little bit of help. Thank you. 